Hello there and welcome back to another video. Today guys, we are getting out of the Noob to Pro scripting tutorial series. In today's video, I'm going to be telling you guys how to use returning. It's quite simple guys, so you will not need to worry about anything in today's video. I think you guys will probably get the hang of it a bit later on um, in today's video right now when I fully explain this. But before I start anything off, I'll be here and tell you guys all about returning. I first need to go in and tell you a little bit about rblxcodes.com, which is my own Roblox code website where you can find out game codes, music codes and guides. There is tons of stuff in there that you guys have to check out overall we give a code for over 1000 roblox games so if you guys need a code for a game it will be there anyway guys i guess let's just go ahead and go on into this video now so guys what exactly is returning well let me quickly explain in a script right now guys let's add a script over here so pretty much returning is used when you guys are using functions so let's just define a function local function um test over here right now guys and let me just quickly enter this in over here so guys um let me just show you guys how we would well how i explained functions last video so pretty much guys normally we would have like a variable for example local number um is equal to zero normally we would have like a variable outside and we'll change it and change this in the function i think i showed you guys me doing this um in the la in the functions video specifically but then we would do something like number is equal to number plus seven and then we would print number over here guys in the function and sorry um number over here right now guys for example print number in the function and then we'll just actually call the function to run so for example guys this is going to print seven as you can see over here guys right now so that's kind of how i showed you guys functions earlier but there is another way that you guys can kind of do this and well i mean both ways kind of have the uses and both ways kind of have the benefits guys so i'm going to show you when to use for turning so pretty much guys um instead of doing this guys so in this case we are actually knowing what the number value is inside the function we could do return number and what that is going to go in and do guys is actually um tell us what the value of this number variable is when the function is complete over here guys also whenever you guys are using return you'd always probably um you'd always use that at the end at, at right at the end of the function over here guys it will not work if i actually put it before this it always has to be at the end of the function guys just to let you know but pretty much guys yeah you do that over there but um as you can see right now guys if i just do this nothing's gonna happen because we actually do not have a variable assigned to this so what we'd actually do over here guys to know what the number is we would do this so local um we'll, we'll make a new variable over here local new number um we'll set that to um so, sorry we'll do new number and that's test so pretty much now guys um if we do print new um number if we do print new number now guys what's going to happen here it's going to print seven so how exactly does this work well pretty much guys when it's returning number it's essentially imagine um right at the end it's saying return it's returning the number and just think about it as converting this whole test function into the value of the, the value of the number which is seven right now guys so imagine this turning into seven when it reaches this line and reaches return number over here guys so essentially what it's doing um in this line it is setting the new number variable to the value of this return so number is the thing that's returning and number is equal to seven um in this instance guys so pretty much that is returning for you all but and um, when would you actually use this guys well let me quickly explain over here so you probably use returning if you guys had a value in a function that you wanted to then maybe change later on over here so for example it's really hard for me to think of something off the top of my head over here guys but for example let's just say you had like a yeah this is so hard to think on the top of my head guys but pretty much you'd use it whenever there is a um well like when, when the job of a function is to maybe create a value and you want to use that value um later on for example maybe we want to um use the new number later on but this time guys we want to do um like print new number plus i don't know um plus 10 but let's say we didn't want to add the 10 inside the function if you guys get what i mean it's quite hard to explain guys um but that is pretty much pretending for you as you can see return 17 over there but pretty much guys yeah that's returning I, I hope i kind of explained this well guys it is kind of hard for me to do this um so hopefully i can go ahead um i hope you guys did get the hang of this guys it's quite hard it's one of the hardest ones in my opinion to actually explain and when to use it properly but guys um you'll definitely see this used a lot more in the script and series right now guys but yeah that's pretty much returning for you um it it kind of like it brings the value outside the function so sometimes we wouldn't right let me let me quickly do this guys so if we do 
well, I, I honestly, guys, that's for tending for you. I think that's the best I can explain it. If not, I'm gonna start explaining stuff in a really, really bad way. <laughs> but hey, yeah, guys, that's pretty much gonna be it for this video here. If you guys do need any help from me, you probably are not gonna wanna have any help from me after today's video because, to be fair, yeah, I was kind of struggling at the end of there to, to explain that, guys. But I will try and help you guys out as much as possible on my Patreon account where you guys can receive one-to-one -one help from me. But yeah, guys, that's going to be it for this video here. That was returning. But yeah, guys, I hope you all did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe to show some support. And peace out.